congratulations to Lafayette. Um, you know, it's obviously a close game and uh, had our chances at the end. Had our chances at the end for sure, but um, give them credit. Disappointing, disappointed. Uh, the second straight week we didn't play very good on offense, and that's disappointing to me because I uh, thought we battled defensively, hung in there, gave up a lot early on defense, but uh, kind of settled in and uh, had a couple good drives on offense in the first half, I thought, but uh, certainly had some chances there. But you can't turn the ball over twice in the red zone like we did, and you know, and we just had an opportunity there to at least tie it or go up, I thought, and put a little bit more pressure on them and maybe where they just don't, you know, can't run it every down. But um, we never were, never were really able to regain the lead and kind of force them out of what they were doing. But I uh, thought we hung in there. I said it was a great game. thought our kids played extremely hard. Both teams did. We competed. Just needed to make one more play, possibly, and, uh, and didn't, so. Well, I mean, you can say that, but if we hit one at the end, we win, you know, so whatever. Yeah, I mean, it kind of swung the game for a second, but we battled back and had opportunity, I thought, to uh, – so, no, it definitely, you know, maybe uh, prevented us from taking the lead, I think. I don't know if it swung the game, but it took – you know, I thought that was a big opportunity for us that we didn't capitalize, so I agree with that. But, I mean, I, you know, it was the middle of the second, third quarter, so I don't think it was necessarily the game. It was just wasted opportunities for us. As you say, they gave us great field position. And, uh, you know, threw a pick in the end zone, and then uh, we had the fumble, which I didn't see. But I don't know. It's disappointing because I thought we had our, our chances there. Just that last series, I mean, it just it seemed like kind of some confusion, not on you guys' part, but just with the call there and not really knowing what's, what's, what's happening there. What's yeah, I, I couldn't tell. And, you know, the only thing I could tell was – the, you know, the D. Gillespie was kind of pointing at himself. And uh, so, you know, the guy said that all three wide receivers were all off the ball. And that's a penalty. So, but, uh, you know, and it was a little confusing because, uh, you know, I wanted to take a shot. You know, I wanted to take one shot at it and then kick. I didn't want to kick with whatever seconds was on there. I thought we needed to take a shot at it. And so we did. You know, Caleb told him, hey, if you don't like anything you don't like, make sure you throw it out of bounds and uh, and we'll line up for the kick. And I uh, thought Craig hit it good. It was just off the right hash. And I mean, he barely missed it because, I mean, I had a great angle at it. And it's one of those deals where you wanted it to hook, you know, it was just kind of hanging there and and just stayed there. But uh, like I said, it's a good game. You know, congratulations to Lafayette. Uh, they got a good football team. They, you know, they come as advertised with the running backs. I mean, the running backs are really good players. And, uh, well, they're hard to tackle, you know, for four quarters. But, again, I thought defensively we really hung in there, gave us a chance. Hey, you, look, you look at it now, I mean, being 6-6 six and six is um, going to kind of leave you up, up there, up in the air with the bowl picture. Um, you know, I don't know how, how do you approach that with the team. You just wait back and see because, I mean, it's nothing you can really control at this point. No, I mean, we're going to have a normal Sunday tomorrow. And uh, regardless of if we won or lost, I mean, Next week will pretty much be a you know be a week off. I mean they'll just lift and stuff. We're going to give them off regardless of uh, you know unless we won and Arkansas State won. I mean Texas State won. You know that would have been different. But um, we we planned really you know and I had a plan if in case of that scenario. But the the both of the other plans were that our guys are going out recruiting this week and uh, you know because regardless I mean we won't know anything and then you know even if you do get one I'm assuming it's the 15th, 22nd, or 29th. I mean, that's kind of the dates, you know. So we kind of, right now, if you go in my office, which I know you will, Adam, I have three different plans. One for the 15th, one for the 22nd, one for the 29th. So anyway, they got nice they got nice stacks, and they're ready to be handed out. So, uh, you know, it's – I don't know how all this works and stuff. And uh, you know, I think, Adam, you and I were talking last week, you know, there was – only one model didn't have both of us in you know, that I was looking at and stuff. So I think probably it depends on how everything goes today, too. Who wins, who loses. Because I know there was a bunch of teams that could that could play to six. Wasn't that correct? I think there were some teams that – so we'll just have to wait and see. But I want to thank uh, – before I go, I really want to thank the, the, our fans because I thought it was a great atmosphere. Lafayette brought people and it was just a really good atmosphere and it was it was fun and – no, there were people, and so anyway, certainly no excuses there. We had the support today. Thanks.